This is the difference. When you are dealing with a sample, we write it as X bar. When you are dealing with a population, we write it as anybody, what is it called? Mu. Mu. Exactly. So X bar, that's the note for, that's the symbol for sample mean, and mu, that's what is used for population mean. Now we are going to use, so if you are looking at any kind of simple data set, like here we have years of education, how do you find the X bar? You just add everything up. The formula I showed you in this handwritten one, X1, X1 will be, you look at the table, your X1 will be 12. X2, if you look at the table, 16. X3, 14. X4, 12. X5, 16. X6, 18 and so on. So simply said, when you have this kind of ungrouped data to calculate your X bar, you just add up everything and then you divide that one by the number you have. That's the N. So in this situation, it will be what? You add everything up and then you find out. Anybody has a calculator? I do forgot to bring it up. Let's see. Okay, 312, that's 36 plus 14, 50, 50 plus uh, 48, no, 50 plus 48 is 98, 98 plus 16, that's what, 114, 114 plus 18, 122, 144, 154, 154, so 154 divided by how many numbers we have? 10, 10 subjects. So the average years of education for 10 people is 15.4 years. That's all. 